Hey mathematicians, it's Sarah at Geeky Teachy. I'm here today to show you an elapsed time strategy on a number line. So we're gonna read our word problem and find our start and our end time. Christy arrived at school at 7.45. Her mom signed her out of school at 1.28 for a dentist appointment. How long was Christy in school that day? So I'm going to make my number line and I'm following this pink line at the bottom of my notebook paper so that I can keep my work organized down here. I'm going to label my start time, 7.45 when she arrived at school, and I wanna to move to the next hour. So from 7.45, I need to add 15 minutes to get to the next hour, which would be eight o'clock. Now I can easily count and jump by hours to get close to my end time, 128. So I'm going to make those jumps from eight to nine, 10, 11, 12, one, and I'm labeling each time I intersect with my number line and I'm labeling each of those jumps with the duration that it took. Now from one o'clock, I need to go 28 more minutes to get to 128. So if I count my hours, I have one, two, three, four, five hours. And I'm going to add 15 minutes plus 28 minutes 15 plus 28 gives me 43. So Christy was at school for five hours and 43 minutes. 